What's going on everybody? Welcome back. And today is another MTB unboxing. Now, now we're in to March. That is right, March, are you kidding me? And it's early March, I have to admit, they've really stepped up their game. It is now March 7th and they already have the newest MTV Pro Box out. Fantastic, honestly guys, I cheated a little bit. I think this is my favorite box, I really, really do. Let's jump right into the dibble. I don't wanna do any cuts, I don't wanna do anything like that unless kids start going crazy. But, in the meantime, let's just, let, let's just dive into the box here. Let's just dive right in. Where's that dibble at? Dibble, 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 dibble. All right, so, first up, we have the Lucky Craft 1.5 SSR. Now, if you guys are familiar with this at all, or even something similar. So this is very similar to uh, what was like called the Baby 2, I think, or Baby 1. Um, very, very similar. Uh, and even in color and style. Now this is a red, so they're kind of like playing off of the Rayburn red here a little bit with that red and gold tinge. Um, but this is gonna work great in any shallow body of water for pre-spawn or spawning bass. This is gonna be just fire. Uh, these are like, looks like a four hook, long shanks, little rattle in there. Uh, looks like, sounds like two, yeah, two knockers um, opposed to the big steady rattle. So this is gonna be honestly probably the most fire lure, or is it? It's gonna be one of the most lit lures in this bin. I tell you that right now, but every lure in this is crazy to me. Next up, we have the Stanford Bates Boom Boom Frog. Boom, boom, baby. So, as you guys know, frogs, early spring, they're okay in early spring. You know, mid to late spring, they really turn on, and even into fall, they really get fiery. But uh, I like throwing a frog as much as possible. Now, this one's got a little something different on it. You can see this little patch right here. This little patch supposedly, per their thingamajigger here, supposedly will give you more hookups. Now, what they're trying to do is what is similar that you see a lot of pros do with buzz baits where they throw like a soft plastic on it. This is really just like a piece of Velcro reversed on setting on top. But because it's there, it's gonna feel more like the material of a frog, more, you know, a little harder there, but with a little, you can hear it. You can hear it, you know? And it's, it's gonna, they're gonna really think that it's a decent frog and a real frog. So they're gonna hold on to it a little bit longer as it goes down and mm, set that hook. So this is gonna be great. Um, just really all your lure. So again, staying on topic, this is one of my favorite boxes, bar none, that MTV has done so far. Cause this is all stuff that I throw, love to throw. It, this is like tuned to me. Uh, next up is the Jenko Offspring. Now this is a really cool concept. Um, if you guys know me, I'm a buzz bait fiend. I love throwing top water, all sorts, frogs, buzz baits. Buzz baits are probably my favorite thing to throw. Uh, I have my own custom buzz bait that uh, I don't let you guys really see a lot um, because it's kind of it's kind of a secret. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of a secret. Uh, unless you follow me on Facebook, you probably don't know what it is. But this bad boy, I mean, listen to this. This spring is gonna keep this bad boy chopping and making a lot of vibration in the water. Um, I don't know if this is gonna cause this not to spin. I'm a little worried that it's not gonna chop as good, but um, I might even show you guys a little modification that I would do to this to give it a little bit of extra thump in the water. But all in all, that's a beautiful buzz bait. I like the gold here. Um, there's a, you know, it's, it's a medium quality when it comes to the bend. And, uh, and the head and everything, but that spring, I mean, that's a that's a different, different noise. So, love the color, love the white, uh, love the chartreuse that's in there in the gray. So this is gonna be an awesome, awesome bait, and I'm gonna throw the crap out of that thing. So, they list this for $12.99? You guys are crazy, Lucky Craft, good for you. I hope you get that $12.99 all day and night, that's legit. Okay, next up, we have the Bio Bait Leeches. Um, this is probably my least favorite thing in the whole bag, and I'm not gonna say it's bad, because it's not, it's legit. It's just the least favorite thing in the bag. 
Um, but these are like little leeches, which is pretty, wow. That is legit, look at how thin that is. Oh my gosh, they even smell kind of like leeches. That is crazy. All right, that's, that's serious right there. I personally think that's amazing. I don't know how you're gonna rig, that's awesome. They even show you how to rig it. You can, how do you do this? Well, they're telling you how to rig a bunch of different things, but they're not really telling you how to rig this. Um, I'm gonna say Texas rig, but you're probably gonna have to do it kind of closer to like, um, I don't even know, man, this is kind of crazy. I'm guessing like drop shot, drop shot. I would do this like a drop shot. That's gonna be your best bet because um, of just how light it is. I think I'm gonna throw this here in the very near future. I kind of love the way this looks. It's, it's, it's pretty incredible. And again, this is not a tiny, you know, this is a full sized, I've asked for it multiple times, full size, not sampler bag. This is what we should be getting in every single box, guys, right here. So MTB killed it. Last but not least, we have the B8 Lab SQ Worms. This, what's really cool about this bag is they are perfectly made for these worms um, in their length and their size. So this is like, to me, really well done. Um, now this is cool. These rings are a little bit heavier. It even has eyes, guys. Look at this. Can you lock back in on this, please? Whoop, whoop. Yeah, there it is. Look at those eyes, dude. That is legit. That is so cool. And the colors are killer. It's a super natural color. Um, it's got some red flake in there, a little black flake. Uh, very natural color. Uh, this is gonna be great in clear water with a little bit of tinge. It's also gonna work really well. Uh, you don't want super dark water. They're not really gonna be able to see it, but it is dark enough to get away with a lot. Um, this is gonna be a six piece. So that's, you know, that's normal size. Um, and the color is perfect. I love, I love the ribs on this thing. It's got a really crazy look to it. And I'm thinking, you know, Wacky Rig, this will work really well. I think Texas Rig, this will work really well. Um, wow, that's a great worm. It's a great worm, guys. Um, wow, this is, for me, a 10 out of 10 on the box world. Um, I'm, I'm loving it. I think this is by far one of the best boxes that we've gotten in a while. I, and honestly, I wanna know if you guys agree with me. Do you guys think that this is one of the better boxes that we've gotten from MTB in at least a year, I would say? Um, I complained last month about how we needed more hard baits. We got them. We, we got them. <laughs> um, we definitely did. They're right here. Boom, okay? We got three hard baits, two soft plastics. That's a perfect mix, in my opinion. This is what us as consumers of buying this month in and month out want. You're allowed to get away with a couple months where it's not, I get it. But this, this is perfect. This is the perfect combination to me. One normal hard bait, a frog, and a buzz bait. This is money. Um, now, I really feel like I've gotten my money's worth. These are all things I really wanna throw. You know, I would probably have never bought these leeches, but I'm gonna throw these um, probably this weekend actually on the river as a drop shot. I think that that's gonna work really, really well. So, and even this bad boy, and I wanna throw my stuff this weekend and uh, that I've been making, and this thing just looks amazing. So, this is a 10 out of 10, guys. 10 out of 10. Give me, right, in the, in the comments down below, hit me with a one to 10 of what you guys call on this exact box. Maybe you didn't get this box, but let me know what you think on this box that I received. Then tell me about your boxes down in there. Guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. If you would, like, comment, subscribe. Uh, I'm really close to 3,000 subs and that would just, I, I can't even believe I'm that close. So please guys, really would appreciate it. Give it the thumbs up hit the subscribe button, and until next time guys, you know the deal. Happy Foozin.